Hi, this is Mrs. Freifeld. Today I'm going to show you how to, to divide by two digits, and they're all going to be multiples of tens. Remember there are four steps to dividing, and you can remember them by remembering does McDonald's sell burgers for divide, multiply, subtract, and bring down. The first thing you do is cover up every number except the one you're working with. And my first step is to divide. How many groups of 20 can I get out of 9? I can't get any groups of 20 out of 9 because 20 is larger than 9. And now I'm going to multiply. 0 times 20 is 0. After I multiply, I subtract. 9 take away 0 is 9. And now I'm going to bring the next number down. I'm just going to uncover one at a time. Now I see that 20 is larger than 95. Well, here's the strategy I want you to learn. You don't know your 20s times tables, but you do know your 2s. I want you to cover up everything but the 2s. If you cover up one digit here, I want you to cover up one digit there. And now I want you to say your 2s until you go over 9. 2, 4, 6, 8, 10 goes over 9. Stop and take the last finger away. I can get four groups of two out of nine. So the number of fingers is what I write at the top. But the difference with this problem is now you're not going to multiply by two. You need to multiply by 20. So somewhere on the side of your paper, you need to write 20 times four. Zero times four is zero. Two times four is eight. I'm going to write 80 underneath the 95. And now that I've multiplied, I'm going to subtract. 5 minus 0 is 5. 9 minus 8 is 1. And I'm going to bring the next number down. Again, I want you to use the strategy cover 1 and cover 1. I do that with a little piece of paper. Now I'm going to say my 2's until I go over 15. 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16. 16 goes over. I stop. I take my last finger away. And the number of fingers is what I write at the top. But remember, I just covered that 0. It's still there. I have to multiply that 7 by 20. 0 times 7 is 0, and 2 times 7 is 14. And that's what I'm going to write underneath the 159. And now my next step after multiplication is to subtract. 9 take away 0 is 9. 5 take away 4 is 1. There's nothing else to bring down. So that 19 must be my remainder. Okay, let's see how we do if we divide by 30. Cover up everything but the number you're working with. How many groups of 30 can I get out of 7? 0, because 30 is bigger than 7. And now I'm going to multiply. 0 times 30 is 0. And then I'm going to subtract. 7 take away 0 is 7. And I'm going to bring my next number down. Now here's my strategy. I don't know my 30s times tables, but I know my 3 song. I'm going to cover one. And if I cover one there, I cover one here. I'm going to sing my 3s until I go over 7. 3, 6, 9. That goes over, I take the last finger away, and the number of fingers is what I write at the top. But notice I have to multiply by 30. So I'm going to do 30 times 2. 0 times 2 is 0. 3 times 2 is 6. So I'm going to write a 60 underneath that 76. Now I need to subtract. 6 take away 0 is 6. 
7 take away 6 is 1. Now I'm going to bring my next number down. And I'm going to use my strategy. Cover one here, so I cover one here. And now I'm going to sing my three song. 3, 6, 9, 12, 15, 18. 18 goes over. I stop. I take my last finger away. And the number of fingers is what I write at the top. But remember, with multiplication, I have to multiply by 30. So I have 30 times 5. 0 times 5 is 0. 3 times 5 is 15. So I write 150 at the bottom. And now I need to subtract. 5 take away 0 is 5, and 6 minus 5 is 1. There's no more numbers to bring down, so 15 must be our remainder. Now we're going to be dividing by 4 digits in the dividend, but that doesn't matter. We're just going to cover all of them up with the ones we're working with. The first step is to divide. How many groups of 40 can I get out of 8? 0, because 40 is bigger than 8. And now I'm going to multiply. 0 times 40 is 0. My next step is to subtract. 8 take away 0 is 8. And I'm going to bring my next number down. I'm only going to uncover one at a time. Now I need my strategy. I'm going to cover one here, so I'm going to cover one here. And now I'm going to sing my four song. Four, eight. Okay, I hit it exactly and it took me two fingers. But remember, I have to multiply by 40, not four. Forty times two, well, zero times two is zero. And four times two is eight. So I'm going to write an 80 at the bottom. My next step is to subtract. 1 take away 0 is 1. And now it's time to bring the next number down. Before you use your strategy, I need you to look at this. Isn't 40 larger than 19? then you can't get any groups out of 40 out of 19, so you write a 0 on top. And then 0 times 40 is 0. And now I'm going to subtract. 19 take away 0 is 19. And now it's time to bring the last number down. Well, 40 is bigger than 196, so I'm going to use my strategy. I'm going to cover one, and I'm going to cover one, and I'm going to sing the four song. Four, eight, twelve, sixteen, twenty. Twenty goes over. Stop, take the last finger away, and the number of fingers is what you write at the top. I put a four up there. But remember, when I multiply, I have to multiply by forty. So it's forty times four. 0 times 4 is 0. 4 times 4 is 16. So I'm going to put 160 at the bottom. My next step is to subtract. 6 minus 0 is 6. 9 minus 6 is 3. There are no more numbers to bring down. So that's our remainder. The remainder is 36. Now we're going to try one dividing by 50. I'm going to cover up everything but the first numbers. How many groups of 50 can I get out of 6? 0, because 50 is bigger than 6. Now I'm going to multiply. 0 times 50 is 0. And then I subtract. 6 take away 0 is 6. 
And now I need to bring the next number down. So down comes the 9. I'm going to cover one here, and I'm going to cover one here. How many groups of 5 can I get out of 6? 5, 10. I can get one group of 5 out of 6. But remember, I have to multiply by 50. And we know that 50 times 1 is 50. So that's what I write at the bottom. My next step is to subtract. 9 minus 0 is 9. 6 minus 5 is 1. I'm going to move this over a little bit, and I'm going to bring the next number down. And I'm going to use my strategy again. Cover 1, cover 1. I'm going to say my 5s. 5, 10, 15, 20. I went over 19. I stop. I take my last finger away. And the number of fingers is what I write at the top. And now I'm going to multiply. But remember, I have to multiply by 50. So 50 times 3 is what I write down here. 0 times 3 is 0. 5 times 3 is 15. So I'm going to put 150 at the bottom of this problem. Now my next step is to subtract. 8 take away 0 is 8. 9 take away 5 is 4. And now I'm going to bring my last number down. Again, use your strategies. Cover 1, cover 1. Say your 5's until you go over 48. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45. I never went over 48, and it took me 9 fingers to get there. And now I'm going to multiply. But I've got to remove the covers, and I've got to remember that I have to multiply by 50. 0 times 9 is 0. 4, I mean 5 times 9 is 45. So I'm going to write a 450 at the bottom of this problem. And now I'm going to subtract. 1 take away 0 is 1. 8 minus 5 is 3. There are no more numbers to bring down. So that's mark my remainder. You did a fabulous job. I'm going to give more practice problems later. Bye for now. This is Ms. Freifeld.